and uh, awkward set of circumstances so it might clean up and it'll save a few blokes like this one very awkward conditions there at the moment the real risk for Garth Tander and everybody else is you could lose a car here if you're not careful now the people that are on wet tyres and have been committed to them for a while Matthew what they're doing is they're running around trying to make heat hoping the track conditions will improve and just trying to press on there are others who are on slicks hoping the world will come to them as well but then the guys that are safely in they're playing a different game they're quietly wandering around warming wets in case they need them for the next leg of qualifying so depending on who you focus on in the field we're not 100 percent sure what they're all doing there's probably three distinctively different strategies in play at the moment but nothing is laying a glove on jamie wincup who still remains at the top Another one down the escape road. I think uh, that was an HRT car this time. And down here, even if the rain stops beneath those trees and in the braking area here for turn two, that'll be a bit tricky. We're going to stay on board here with Garth. So therefore, that was Mark Scaife down the escape road. And it'll give you a great idea of the layout of the racetrack. This is turn three. That's the weather, or the lack of it, that Daniel was talking about before. How's all the second gear wheel spin on exit? Car bursts into wheel spin, so Garth just gently nudges the throttle off the corner. Painted ripple strips and white paint. Big drama on street circuits. Look at the camber in the road, the crowning in the road. That's an issue. A little bit of a dry groove appearing there on the loaded side of the car from the warmth of the tyres. That was five where Bridie went wide. This is six. Lots of brake locks yesterday in practice of the approach. And this short shoot between six and seven has got the kink in it. Right there on the left, bang, is where Will Davison hit the wall at Cannon him into the big pond sign on the right. And then seven to eight's got a kink in it. This is the last left-hander that then brings you back on to pit straight. The pit lane entry is off to the right there. down here quite bumpy on the braking approach lots of people are finding their way down that escape road the time has run out for uh, the first leg of qualifying and assuming that nobody can post a better flying time that they're still on Stephen Richards will survive the cut but Russell Ingle will be the first one out so positions 21 to 29 while we stay on board with GTR Ingle, Dumbrell, Bright, Morris, Jason Richards. Hang on, correction, because that's changed. Russell Ingle's fired himself. Uh, no, somebody else has jumped up it's in getting, order. It's and good. it's now Stephen Richards, Russell Ingle, Dumbrell, Morris, Jason Richards, Patrizzi, Marshall, Scott, and Alberto. It is getting a bit better out there, Matt. You can start to see, even from our vantage point,